most commonly submerged tooth is the options are permanent mandibular second molar deciduous mandibular second molar permanent maxillary canine and permanent mandibular first molar now if you know the exact terminology of submerged tooth the other name is ankylosed deciduous tooth it is of the primary dentition that you will use this word now a submerged tooth is similar to an ankylosed tooth that means it is fused to bone and fails to exfoliate so normally in the eruption and shedding pattern it will erupt normally it will start to have its root resorption but at one point of time it becomes ankylosed to bone meaning it fuses to bone and fails to fall it does not exfoliate so because of this the permanent tooth that is developing underneath does not get the place to erupt now because the permanent tooth is also locked and this tooth is also in its position the alveolar process will still continue to grow so what happens is the surrounding teeth will appear higher than the plane of occlusion and this tooth appears submerged right that is why this terminology is used now clinically you can identify uh, with the help of clinical assessment and radiograph of course on the radiograph you can see that although the root resorption is significant there is no mobility in the tooth and it falls to exfoliate now on percussion this tooth is going to have a little difference in the uh, sound so normally when you percuss a tooth you will get a cushioned kind of a sound but here you will get a solid sound okay so this solid sound is suggestive of submerged tooth now the reasons for this kind of a disturbance could be a local metabolism defect it could be because of trauma infection it could be because of genetics or a combination of these conditions the treatment protocol is to remove this tooth so that there is no malocclusion because of failure of eruption of the permanent tooth underneath now the most common tooth that is submerged is the mandibular second molar of course we are talking about deciduous dentition so the correct answer is option number 2